Good evening, hyperspinners. Today I'm going to uh, talk you through the idle volume adjuster. Uh, this will basically mute your system after so many minutes or turn the volume down. Uh, so let's get started. <laughs> guys we're gonna go to hyperspinfe.com I'll post the uh, link in the description below but all we're gonna do is uh, download the idle volume adjuster uh, on the third-party app section of the downloads uh, there are other uh, apps that are similar to this uh, but I prefer this one uh, out of the others uh, this was created by the man DJ VJ uh, which we all know the man so I'm uh, supporting him um, so all you've got to do is download the, uh, the app here and this is uh, very quick and easy to set up guys so go ahead and uh, download that and put it in the hyperspin rocket launcher folder uh, now I, I realize that you guys could have rocket launchers uh, folder in a different location uh, I do have it in the hyperspin folder um, going old school here uh, so yeah once you've opened up rocket launcher folder uh, you'll create a new folder called idle volume and what you're gonna do is you're just gonna unzip the contents that you just downloaded and you're gonna paste them in here uh, all of these files are agn agnostic to your uh, setup in terms of the drive letter so all you've got to do is paste those in there in the folder and then what you want to do is uh, modify the uh, INI file. So I'm going to go ahead and open that. And all the instructions are laid out up at the top. Uh, very easy, uh, straightforward. And my settings uh, I'll post on the mega site uh, as an example. Uh, but basically I've got after 360 seconds, it's going to uh, change the volume down to, uh, you know, this level so you, you kind of have to tinker through it until you uh, get used to uh, the settings um, but you, you'll find it uh, and you can test it uh, using this uh, test uh, pause uh, you can just uh, essentially uh, uh, to play it uh, but that, that's that's it guys um, there's nothing uh, really to this just uh, drop it in your uh, rocket launcher idle volume folder and uh, once you've got a uh, the setting that you're after, um, you know it, when you're you're testing it, uh, the volume adjuster. Once you open up Hyperspin, the adjustment doesn't happen until the seconds that you put in that INI file. Uh, so as long as you're not touching uh, the Hyperspin setup, like if you're just letting it go into a track mode, or if you're in um, a game and uh, just aren't pushing any buttons that idle volume adjuster will basically change the volume from you know X to Y so it it just turns it down so it's not a, a you know bothersome uh, to others so to finish this setup uh, all we're gonna do is go to your startup scripts and what you're gonna want to do is uh, just put this in the startup as well as shutdown uh, section so I'm going to go to hyperspin. I'm going to go to my folder that has the startup script. And so we're going to open up the INI file here, the hyperspin startup. If you haven't seen the video on the startup script, uh, I definitely recommend it, but it's pretty straightforward. So I'm going to scroll down here and I'm going to look up startup, uh, this section here. And I've got, uh, keeping me honest, here we go. The startup is here and you just put in the path and you put in the XE and then you'll want to also close that app when you close Hyperspin. So um, there's the close part and uh, that's all there is to it. So um, there's nothing really I can uh, demo here. Um, it'd be kind of a boring video if not 
already boring. <laughs> uh, but the volume will change on you guys and uh, add it to your setup. Uh, that's it. Uh, we'll catch you next time. Bye.